Finally tonight, Colorado faces a long road to recovery following this week's historic flooding. Lyons, Colorado saw the worst of it. But as Anna Werner reports, people there are already fighting for a comeback. We will never take this for granted. For this football game, the coach delivered a pep talk full of emotion. I believe in the end, there's going to be a lot more good memories that come out of this than bad. Just over a week ago, floodwaters consumed these players' hometown. Residents don't know when or if they'll be able to return. So many came here. Players and cousins, Gaspar and Aaron Vasquez, both lost their homes in the flood. Couldn't much do anything, like go like always wet, but when I went out to practice, like I felt like I was back again. Are you ready for Lions victory? Because we are ready. Abby LaCory is a sophomore cheerleader. Just trying to see all my friends and just keep my head up because I know it will get better in the end, but we just have to get through the hard times together. Class in a loaned building here in Longmont for now. Most are living in temporary homes. Some members of the band played loaned instruments today. Karen Gregg is band director. They want normalcy and in such an uncertain time, something as normal as playing for a football game can be really reassuring. The game wasn't trouble free. In the second quarter, a player broke his leg. We got to overcome again. This is one more thing thrown at us. But Lions still won the game, 28 to 7. Anna Werner, CBS News, Longmont, Colorado.